Welcome back everyone to another gear review. Uh, today I ordered this purple panda lavalier microphone and gonna open this up and see what it looks like. Okay, so first things first. Uh, honestly, this is not my first one. Uh, I had one before, but the cord died on it. I kind of caught it on something while I was out shooting photography, so it broke. So since I got a new one, want to do a good thorough unboxing and review of it. Uh, so to start off, it comes in this handy little box. Uh, and, you know, we got some user guide. You know, gotta love those. Personally, never read them. Bunch of other stuff, and it comes in this handy little bag. So, what we have inside the bag here? Uh, we got this bubble wrap, and inside the bubble wrap is our microphone. You know, just nice and simple. I uh, love the clip on, love everything about it, although it's got this little fuzzy thing on it. I just want to take off because that serves me absolutely no purpose because as you may know from watching my channels everything I do is outdoors so one of these not gonna help and if you haven't seen my other channels I'll throw a link up to my photography one right now okay so we got the microphone out all good and proper and it comes with a few different adapter cords uh, we have this adapter cord in case you need your stuff longer and there is also this tiny little adapter cord, which will allow you to plug it into a camera. So it just clips onto the end of your microphone. And snips in all nice and tight. And then this can plug into the camera now. Uh, but there's one more thing I need to do since I took the normal little thing off. Oh, it also comes with one of these. Honestly, I'm not sure what this is or what it's for, but, you know, if it's your thing, they could be handy. Okay, so the reason I love Purple Panda microphones is because they come with a little tiny dead cat. Because when you're out shooting outdoors in the wind, you definitely need one of those. So you just take it and you slide it onto your microphone this is a little tricky because frankly it's just tiny and you know nothing wrong with tiny but it makes things a little harder to maneuver okay so I need to make sure it's on good and solid so that it will actually block wind noise I think that's about looking happy so this will be going back on my backpack, exactly like this. Okay, so now one last little thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to test this out and make sure everything's working good on it. Uh, so give me one sec and I will be right back with audio. Okay, so got this plugged in. Uh, this is the audio quality of the Purple Panda microphone hooked up to the Canon M50 uh, before I was using the M50 audio. So hopefully this is sounding better and hope you agree. Uh, regardless, I normally use this with my Zoom H1N, uh, but plugged it into the Canon just to, you know, give a really good accurate comparison. Beautiful lavalier microphone, uh, if you need one would, and do anything outdoors, I would definitely recommend it. The fact that it comes with a dead cat is just amazing, uh, and for the price, I think it's like, I think I picked this one up for about $40 on Amazon, so, you know, definitely a purchase worth making. Well, with that being said, I guess I don't really know what else I have to say about this, so hopefully you found this useful, and if you did, definitely be sure to hit those like and subscribe buttons, and hopefully I will see you next time.